Hello everyone, welcome to day number 5 in the 1000 Players Simulate Civilization in Minecraft. Attention, Aculon announcement, Java connection has been spotted near the near the efficiency at the east side of Ac There are about 8 people chasing Java connection. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. So, Java connection was a guy who um, just randomly killed people. So he was a kill on sight person. So for the coronation, you're gonna need a lot of backstory here. So for the entire time, our actual empire, Alignulo, was not actually able to play because his computer was booty. We had third in command be our leader because second in command also couldn't play. He was finally able to get back today. Then we coronated him. And what you're about to see is the entire coronation process. Each Baron of the Cohort had to bring up a gift, and I brought up a very cool gift. Hearing, 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 in the name of the great Aculon Empire and our Lord Dormat, we are gathered here today as one unit as we welcome a new Emperor upon the grounds of the central peace to our great nation. Let's now bow our heads as we ask for a blessing from our Lord. Lord Dormat, Overseer of the Snow, please grant us your blessing as we anoint our new Emperor as he leads us to victory. Lord Dormat, Guardian of Aculon, please protect us from Satan-ish as he lowers the walls and brings <laughs> violence upon us. Let us pray for prosperity and safety. Amen. Now, let us welcome up our great General Who Drew as he proceeds with the honoring of our loss. Thank you, Soggy. Now, before we begin, this is a full set of diamond. Each one of these pieces that Alanilo wears represents a part of us. We at Aculon are made up of multiple parts, but if we simplify it down to four main ones, here it is. The helmet in Aculon represents all those who died in the farming faction. There were many people who died, sadly, but they died to let us live and eat the bread that we so cherish today. Today we honor them, for them allowing us to prosper and thrive as a nation and not die of starvation. This chest plate represents all those who died in the building factions of Aculon. They let us stand in the castle we sit today. They built the quartermasters that we talk to every day and get the materials that we use. We salute all those who died, whether it be through fall damage or other means of death. Everybody the leggings, seven in chat. <laughs> the leggings represent all those who died in the lumber faction. These men not just get us wood, but they also grab us apples for golden apples. They let us thrive and are the backbone of our nation as wood is used in almost everything in Minecraft. We salute all of them. Finally, the boots. These represent all the dirty and filthy traitors who will die to us. There have been many traitors we have executed over the days, as you guys have seen. But those who have stayed loyal to Aculon, we thank you. We do our best here. Now, the traitors, there's still a couple of you out there. We will find you, and when we do, we will take care of you, just as those who have been taken care of. The miners are the last part of Aculon that need to be represented. They have not just gotten iron, coal, but also the diamond armor that we wear today. There are many who have died to mobs and other forms, such as lava in the caves. We honor these men as they have given their lives for us to be protected, whether it be when borders drop to other nations or the traitors and random killers that live in our very walls. Today, we honor every part of Aculon, not just the top members, not just Alanilo in Turkey, but every single citizen, all those who have given their lives for what we work so hard to achieve. The miners, the lumbers, the builders, and the farmers. We salute all of you who have died. Thank you. Thank you, Turkey. Now at this time, each Baron will bring up a gift from their cohort, showing their respect to the Emperor-elect. Cohort Uniform would like to present you with this ax, dubbed the Spruce Splitter, as <laughs> a, lot, a lot of the wood is spruce. I will cherish this axe. And Thank then you. after the coronation, I made a shelter far, far away from any other Aculon area for reasons I will not disclose in this video. But now just know that I have a shelter far away. Let's just say the upcoming videos may be getting a lot more intense. All right, that's all I'm going to say. But that was pretty much it in day number five for State. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And make sure to stay tuned for the next ones because the next ones is where it's going to get intense. Borders are going to drop. There's going to be wars. 
There's going to be a little bit of infighting, I think. So, I'll leave you on that note, and good.